In this lecture, we'll be taking a look at some of the common functions available for a string. And here, you can see I've created a class called dummy, and the constructor initializes the variable n with the value that we are passing. And then we have two methods over here, repr and str. So, usually when we print the value, the str method gets called and it prints the statement that we have defined. And for repr is basically used to print the best representation of a given variable in string form. And here you can see we have customized it. If we do not do that, and let's go ahead and delete this for a moment. Save this. And let's run this now. So here you can see when we are printing x, it's just saying str the number of dummy is this. And for other two, you can see that it is just printing the class object and with its identity. But if I give this value definition repr the number of dummy is, in that case, when you run this, you'll notice for both these functions repr and ASCII, same result is getting printed. And the only difference between RPR and ASCII is that ASCII will only print ASCII character codes and RPR will take care of the Unicodes as well. So that's the only difference between RPR and ASCII. And uh, there was some of the commonly available methods for a string in Python.